Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today we're going to be unboxing my July BoxyCharm. So let's just get right into it. So if you're new to my channel and you don't know what BoxyCharm is, it's a monthly subscription service where you get four to five full size to deluxe size samples ranging from anything in the beauty world. So that can be makeup, skincare, nail polishes, perfumes, the list is really endless. They surprise us each month with great products. Most of the time, the box retail value is over $100 and you only pay $21 a month and can cancel at any time. So with that being said, let's just get into this box. So each month they do send you a little card with the price of all the products and in the front it has a theme and this month's theme is cutie pie and it looks like that's a cherry pie which is so cute and then I do want to mention that BoxyCharm has recently started to do this with their packaging so it's kind of like a foam on the base and top of the box which really helps protect all the products and I honestly appreciate that because I haven't had a product come in broken in months it did happen to me only one time and I've been subscribed to BoxyCharm for such a long time so I do appreciate the change in how they box their products because that just shows that they're really taking precaution so your products don't come in broken so with that being said let's go ahead and get into the first product this is the blink times boxy charm electric eyes eyeshadow palette and in the card it says this is by blink cosmetics and it retails for 45 dollars this palette features a combination of five highly pigmented jewel tone eyeshadows the shades beautifully pair together to give a gorgeous golden eye look. This formula blends effortlessly and long lasting. And another thing I love about BoxyCharm is they always give you tips under the products. So I think that's always helpful, especially if you're a beginner with makeup. And also BoxyCharm does give two to three sneak peeks every month. So I do know about three products that will be in this month's box, but sometimes they can vary. This was the main product that was going to be in the box. And this is what this eyeshadow looks like. It's absolutely beautiful. So let's get to swatching. They are all shimmer shadows. And wow, they're cons the consistency of these shadows is kind of like a bouncy feel. Like, I don't really even know how to explain it. And the pigmentation is no joke with this palette. This is insane. Okay, so I barely pressed down, like in the pan I didn't like destroy the pan because sometimes I feel like people press down too hard and so I didn't press down too hard I swatched them and look at this pigmentation that is stunning like the shades applied so nicely and I can even like go in and blend it out more and it's still like so pigmented and I don't even have more product on my hand that really says a lot this formulation is beautiful I cannot wait to apply this on my eyes the one thing I do want to say is they are all shimmers so you do not get a matte shadow um, they're all five shimmers so you will need like a matte to apply in your crease I personally like using my shadows in my crease but you know makeup is however you want to wear it so if you want to do shimmers all over your eye you certainly can but I personally prefer mattes in my crease and in the outer portion of the eye and then shimmers in the inner third or all over the lid this is a beautiful palette I cannot wait to try it out let me know if you guys would like to see a tutorial with this like exclusively or just like do another boxy charm like testing boxy charm makeup I did one of those previously let me know if you guys would like me to do another one and I could definitely do that for you guys the next thing I see in the box is this project beauty spray set go makeup setting spray and it's two fluid ounces 
And on my little card, it says it retails for $32. That's crazy. Keep your makeup fresh all day. Just spray, set, and go. You've got this gorgeous. That's so cute. Um, okay, so this retails for $32. I'm not sure if this is full size or not because it doesn't say it on the card, but I mean, it could be full size, two fluid ounces. I mean, who knows? Let's go ahead and see how this little guy sprays. Okay, oof. This, <laughs> this kind of doesn't spray as finely as I would like it to. It kind of just like spit at my face, honestly. Let me go ahead and dry that off because I can, let me zoom you guys in. I can see like where it left water or the spray, especially on my forehead. So that's not a cute look. I'm trying to dry that off um, for $32 and it does that. Maybe I need to like break it in, spray it in and spray it a couple times, but first impressions of that, I'm not that big of a fan. Even my hard candy, which is like under $10, like spray has like a better mist than this one. And this one seems to be pricey. So I'm not quite sure how I feel about that. That could have ruined my makeup. So maybe I wouldn't use it to set my makeup, maybe to prime it and then kind of let it sink into the skin. I mean, it doesn't have a scent or anything like that, just the consistency of how it's sprayed is something I'm not a fan of. And next we have this little guy. What is this? It has really pretty packaging, like the gold. That's so pretty. This is the Unibrow Universal Eyebrow Pencil by Winkly Lux, and this retails for $12. One brow pencil to rule them all. Simplify your brow game with this two-step pencil. Its firm texture gives maximum control so anyone can be a brow boss. Oh wow, it is two-sided. Okay, so this is a brow pencil, and it kind of has that like thick, tip like kind of like the triangle tip and I'm going to swatch it for you guys it does have a really dry consistency so I honestly don't know how this will work out but it does also come with the spoolie so I shall test this out and let you know I honestly don't feel like this is very universal if you have like platinum blonde hair I feel like this color might not work for you but if you have like brunette hair maybe uh, like I said we shall see and next in the box is this ColourPop lippy and it's an ultra matte lip and this was one of the products that was revealed at the beginning of the month but it was I think like maybe six shades that you could possibly get so this is the Ultra Matte Lip by ColourPop and its retail price is $6. The description is this thin lightweight formula smoothly glides on the lips leaving super intense pigment with a bold ultra matte look. It is very long lasting, 100% kiss proof aka no transferring. The description is nice. Um, I honestly have never tried ColourPop until today when I did like this look which will be up Sunday July 23rd if you want to see how I got this look um I tried ColourPop and I guess you'll just have to see my review to see how I feel about the brand but this is the ultra matte lip that I got and it's in the shade Notion it's a really pretty vampy color looks like this which swatches really nicely I just kind of wish they would have given more like maybe a bold pink like bolder colors for the summertime because this I probably won't wear until like winter if I even wear it because I'm not really into these really dark vampy colors I might wear it for a tutorial but for day to day honestly I wouldn't wear it so yeah I just wish they would have included like summer colors like maybe something to go along with this like beautiful like summery eyeshadow palette like 
maybe not summery because I feel like these colors you can use all year round but I just wish they would have put like a summer lip in here instead of like a vampy lip and the last thing in the box is the item I was most anxious and most excited for I received the bare minerals invisible light translucent powder duo and this retails for $32 and it's by Bare Minerals. And the description is the silky and ultra fine combination of setting powder and finishing powder instantly vanishes on all skin tones. Enjoy an even long lasting natural look, luminous complexion. So I've been wanting to try this product for I believe a year now. I think it's been out for a year, maybe a year and a half. I've been wanting to try it since it came out, but I never really wanted to pay $32 for it. And when BoxyCharm said this could be in our box or a Bare Minerals sunscreen, I was praying that I would get this little guy because I didn't really care for the sunscreen. Like, I wanted this, and I would have been so upset if I would have got the sunscreen because it's like... I have other sunscreens I like, like I would have preferred this guy, but I'm very, very, very happy I got it. So it comes in this really pretty black sleek packaging and then, ooh, it comes with a nice mirror and then this is the matte, ooh, it had, ah, <laughs> it had protection over it. So this is the matte side and this is like the glowy side. Let me go ahead and swatch it. Oh my goodness, this matte side feels so soft let's go ahead and feel the glow oh that's such a pretty like soft glow and it has kind of like pink marbling through it hopefully my camera can pick it up yeah it has like pink marbling I think this is so pretty like how the how sleek this packaging is makes it seem so much more luxurious than it actually is. I mean $32 you are paying a pretty penny for that but I just love the packaging on this and I hope I love the product as much as I love the packaging. This is a product I'm like ecstatic to try. BoxyCharm just is doing an amazing job with all these boxes each month. I genuinely love them more and more like they just keep getting Better. And this month I'm very happy with the products I got. Let me go ahead and see how much this month's box was worth. So this month's box overall value was $127. That is crazy. I love all the products that we got. We got a lot of high-end stuff. The setting spray, bare minerals, and the blink palette were all like high-end prices. The ColourPop and the Unibrow were more like drugstore prices, retailing at $6 and $12. But I'm very excited for this month's box. Overall, they're pretty good products. The only one I was kind of like eh about was this setting spray just because of how it sprayed. And I feel like the Unibrow wasn't as universal as I would have thought because if you are very platinum and hair color I feel like it wouldn't work for you but I will give it a shot and see how this works and Colourpop all I have to say is watch the video on Sunday and I just wish the color would have been different like I said you guys have to watch the video on Sunday to see how I feel about Colourpop um but overall I am very happy with this month's box they had great products in here that I'm ready to try them out and see how well they work, especially the Spare Minerals Invisible Light Powder Duo. Like, if this works out as good as I'm, like, picturing it in my head, that's going on vacation with me. Like, I'll use that for a setting powder and a highlight, and that's one less thing I have to pack. So, let's hope, let's cross our fingers and hope <laughs> it works out for me. And yeah, so thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And don't forget about the giveaway. All the details will be listed down below. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.